last week's game against Warrington. How did you find the match? Um, Warrington have a big team, strong team. Um, I was very happy to start the game with uh, uh, the boys. Um, just uh, unlucky about the lose, but yeah, I enjoyed my time in the field. I enjoyed uh, to uh, listen to the crowd, and uh, yeah, even we lose, I was uh, like enjoying the, the the moment. And you played bigger minutes than, than you used to. How did you find that? Um, just we work on that uh, with Rich and uh, Juan. Um, just to work on the effort and get ready for play any time, long or short minutes, just get ready for any time. And you got over for a try as well, that must have been pleasing. Yeah, uh, I enjoyed that. It was my first try uh, in Super League. Um, unlucky about the lose, but uh, that's, like I said, I enjoyed my time in the, in the field with the boys and uh, enjoy the score. So next time we will win and I hope I will score again. And, uh, <laughs> and you got it in front of the Leeds fans as yeah. well, behind the post, that must be nice. Yeah, yeah, that was really nice. Uh, yeah, that's, like I said, uh, that was fantastic. And uh, I can't wait to get back again at in Edingley for play for, for Leeds. Playing at Headingley, yeah. is that kind of a good time for the team? The fact that, you know, disappointing result last week, yeah. but being back home in front of our fans this week. Yeah, uh, being back home uh, at the front of our fans, uh, will help the boys to see uh, how the, the people are behind us. Um, yeah, that will be good for the boys and uh, that will give uh, more energy than uh, last, last week. And in terms of what you have been able to learn during pre-season, do you feel like you've improved a lot as a player? Um, I enjoy to improve uh, in the pre-season all my skills and my cardio and everything like that. Um, my vision in the field changed a lot and um, yeah, uh, I feel the, uh, this precision helped me a lot and uh, th when I'm back in the field, uh, I feel more clear. Even I don't speak the good English, um, that's more clear. And of course, you've got Richard Hannix, where he speaks French, has that helped you? Yeah, that helped me a lot. Uh, uh, hopefully he's here and he speaks to me in French because sometimes uh, I don't get uh, all the sentence, uh, all the speech, but hopefully he's there. Uh, started me a lot so yeah it's a good thing for us